After you have set up your course, it's a great idea to add other content and resources on your course and unit pages to further engage your students. In this video, we are going to look at how you can set up and design these pages. You can get to your course and unit pages in a number of ways. You can click on the course icon, select your course, and then use the three dots menu to access the view homepage button. You can also access your course and unit pages from the resources menu. Your course and unit pages will have been made using the course and unit templates that your school has designed, so you may have different components to the ones that I have. Let's start by looking at your course page. The purpose of a course page is to give an overview of what students will learn when completing it. With this in mind, some great components to show on a course page are tiles that link to your units, a text box with a course overview, the curriculum mapping components, and the course criteria component. You can add any components that you like to your course page. One thing to think about, however, is that you will be using this course again in future years, so it's best not to use any collaborative components or anything that won't be relevant next year. For example, social streams, news, calendars, and other like components. Only put things that you will want to use again and again on your course and unit pages. Now let's take a look at your unit pages. If you've created tiles that link to your unit pages, you can use these to navigate to a particular unit. Again, this will be templated with different components depending on what your school has set up. So you might have different components to the ones that I have. There are many different ways that you can set up your unit pages these may vary across subjects, teachers, and cohorts of students. Some great components to use on your unit pages are text boxes for overviews, tiles to link to other units, images, links, and files. You will see that you already have a course builder component on your unit page. This will be populated with all of the tasks, quizzes, and due work that you have already set up. It's important to know that students and parents won't see the course builder. This is only visible to teachers and is used for teachers to build course work. The only way for students and parents to see the content in the course builder is for it to be linked to the class page. They will then see this content on the class page, but never on the unit page. So you don't need to worry about students and parents seeing work before you have made it available to them. You can add new things to the course builder by clicking on the add buttons. You can also add new things by going into the courses area When a course is linked into your class, the tasks, quizzes, and due work that you create in the course builder will act as a checklist and allow students to self-pace their learning and tick them off as they complete them.